cancer researchers are utilizing ERVs to kill tumors and stop cancer. How endogenous retroviruses protect us from viral infections. So this came out in 2021. Another amazing function is called tumor suppression. So because the ERV looks like a retrovirus, what it can do in the cell, Eric, is transcribed ERVs in tumor cells. This is called viral mimicry. The immune system sees that cell and it works together with what's called the guardian of the genome, the P53 protein, an incredibly designed superhero protein. In combination with the P53 protein, the immune system sees that tumor cell, it sees that ERV that's transcribed, and so the immune system attacks it with destruction. And cancer researchers are utilizing ERVs to kill tumors and stop cancer. And so this incredible function, it necessitates the ERV looking like the retrovirus. It's fighting fire with fire. And so when the evolutionists ask, well, why do ERVs look like the retroviruses? That's because many of their functional roles are dependent upon the sequence similarity to retroviruses. It would be like, I'll use this analogy. If an FBI agent were to infiltrate the mob, is he gonna show up with his FBI badge and his name tag? <laughs> He's not gonna get very far, right? He'd have to dress the part. He'd have to, right. look, he'd have to look the part. So the ERVs have to look the part in order to what? Fight off invading viruses. They do that because they literally mimic it it's so that they can get in so that they can kill. What are we doing with this uh, undercover virus or this virus in disguise? Like what, what that's really what it's doing. That's amazing. I, I like that virus in disguise.